Okay, I'm back. <laughs> Thanks, Obama. <laughs> I, don't I always have my brain numbed up from a fangirl who thinks the game is ruined because they didn't rehire the old voices. Of, of what? Final Fantasy VII didn't have voices. Like that? Huh? Yeah, so did not have voices. Wait, a fangirl thinks the game is ruined because they didn't hi hire the old voices? Is she was she serious or was she joking? Maybe from Advent Children? You're in for a world of hurt. You can't name your character? Is it seven? Yeah, you could name all your characters. Because they weren't voice. Who did they... English version or Japanese version? Because... I thought they still had, um... What's his name? Tak Takahiro Sakurai? Being Cloud? Awesome that, that the prequel characters won't be in the remake. Well, of course they won't be in the remake. They're the prequel. <laughs> They're totally different games. Why? I mean, if they just happen to have cameos or Easter eggs referring to them, that's cool. But they they don't have to be in the game. What? That makes no sense. Also, where the hell is this gnome? In the secret passage? I can't I'm jump tired. down anywhere. Screw this. this game. No way. Gotta know when to go. People are silly. He just jumped off from from here. Can I jump off? Can't jump off. Fun fact, she's never played the original. Then what is she getting so upset about? What? <sighs> okay. Um, I'm gonna have to look up a walkthrough. Temple of Earth. Um. Oh! I can break this! So dumb. Oh! Uh. Oh no! I missed it! I missed the treasure chest! Crack! She's even silly for having the audacity claiming to, for the remake to be ruined. Maybe she watched someone play through the original and she's like, Oh yeah, because I saw someone play, like, I have all these feelings too. I'm like, eh. Oh gosh darn. I missed that treasure chest. You can go back. Ruined forever. Oh, okay. Ghost shell. Ghost in the shell. EX gem level 1. You got the first chest. Oh. Woohoo. Oh, so no matter what, like, there's two different paths. Oops, I'm not scanning on a little. You would be able to get the first one you actually got in one go. Uh huh. Developers ruined the lives of voice actors who wanted to reprise their roles that they've been waiting for 10 years and now it's all wasted. Screw this remake. It wasn't voiced. You can't go any further. Screw you. You know what? I don't care about all the other treasure chests and screw you. Oh, you guys. You're the ones that gave me the potion. This must be Big Brother. They all look the same, so it's hard to tell. You want to go back up? Then use this hole. It's a secret patch that only known luts use. Thanks, Big Brother. Big Brother! Wait, did I miss the... Ah, oh, shoot. I... I guess I fell down the wrong bridge. Oh wait, hi. Oh, there you are. There's a big chasm further in. We have to drop the path above down onto it to get past it. I'll go on over there. What do we do there? I'll tell you when we get there. Alright. Oh, okay. I'm going now. But do something about those monsters along the way. It's really annoying when one of them touches me. So I need to make sure no enemies touch you, right? Yeah, I'll raise a big fuss if they do. Escort mission? Oh no. This is the worst. I don't care 
this isn't fades. <laughs> um, I was saying like Big Brother from the Yu-Gi-Oh! Abridged series. Uh, when Moku was talking about Kaiba. I didn't press that again, but okay, cool. I hate this. This is hell. I'm tired of this. Ah, uh, my hunting beast fail. We are be jumping off the wall because I'm losing at a children's card game. I challenge you to a children's card game. <laughs> Dungeon Dice Monsters is nothing like... Uh, Duel Monsters. Yeah, how's it different? You're in My game world. has dice. It's <laughs> 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 really like wanted to explore. Oh gosh, I would be super frustrated too. I'm like, you didn't play the original. There were no voices. What the heck are you talking about? For what it's worth, you said you prefer fighting over fresh quests, and that I did, but I hate escort missions. Worst of all, they are the worst. You get what you wish for. She did not make sense. She also hates Tetsuya Nomura for no reason and wants him to fail. If it wasn't for him, we wouldn't have a lot- Wait, did I mess up? Because- No! Did I fail because I walked in before him? Are you... Are you for real? This is gonna be a piece of cake! Watch this! Oh my go. gosh, I hate this. Oh my... Just because I walked in half a second in front of him, I failed the whole thing. I have to do it all again. Oh my word. This is gonna be a piece of cake. <sighs> she loves Final Fantasy 15, hates Nobuda, but loves the characters that Nobuda designed. Okay. Oh my gosh. 15 was trash. I mean, maybe people like the the buds going on a road trip thing, but oh gosh, the story was pacing was horrible. The story was horrible. The dungeons were horrible. The f battle system was garbage. Oh, more battle. Fifteen sucks. Make it a habit to always wait for the escort because of this stuff. At the very least, the game should stop you. Not in a way to do that. Uh, I should heal Regal. He's at under half health. Oh well, I guess this is getting the character's experience, so I shouldn't be too bad. Just as I expected. Please heal me. <laughs> I shall, I shall. RNA is the only reason to play 15 for real. RNA at best, girl. Nurse! Hello, nurse. She's mad that the old voice actors are screwed over from their roles from Crisis Core! Oh gosh. You're in for a world of hurt. Demo was pretty good, but I got bored after half an hour. Oh man, I was still loving I wish I could have played the demo longer, but I was at E3 and I was like, I can't. I can't play too long because there's other people waiting for their slots to play the game, so I couldn't like fully go around the whole place like I wanted to. I wanted to explore every nook and cranny. Who's next? Even though it's not really like that large of a place. RNA is the girl that crashed at Bachelor Party is the main attraction. Also because of Miyuki Sawashiro! Wait, but he's still- Oh, there he is. Oh, I thought I failed again and I was gonna be so mad. Arne has that bullet. <laughs> Last boss of the demo has way too much health. 
Yeah, because it's a boss. It's gotta be tough. I don't know, is Miyuki? Mm hmm, mm hmm. Best girl. Oh, you're here! So, what do we do now? You and I are going to cause an earthquake at the same time. Then this path will fall down, okay? Get it? We're going to increase the strength of the shop. I'll say one, two, three, so match your timing with mine and use the sorcerer's ring. If we do it a few times, it'll fall. Gotcha. Wanna hear that again? No. No thanks. Okay, then here we go. One, two, three. Do it right. What? Wanna keep going? Yeah. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Once more. One, two, three. Not quite yet. One, two, three. Whoa. Bye bye. Hey, you almost got us killed. Oh, I didn't think about what would happen after it, though. If we didn't have these X spears, we'd be dead. Everybody makes mistakes. Ha 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 ha. Well, I'm going now. Yeah, thanks. For nothing. No, you helped us. <gasps> Save! Oh shoot, is the boss just right here? Oh damn. After 20 minutes of straight fighting the boss, I was like, is this gonna end anytime soon? 20 minutes? Why'd it take you so long? Shouldn't take you that long. 15 should have been what 7 was if no one stayed. A hybrid between Kingdom Hearts and 13. That's what it should have been. That's what everyone wanted. But alas, no. We did not get that. Trisha. Oh, okay, so this is just the way back up. So, um... I'll just go fight Gnome now. Don't touch me. Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Optimal, 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 optimal. Oops, I want to save. This one is thankfully not long. <laughs> Touchy toast things. <laughs> Bad touch. Good touch. No touch. <gasps> so this is Gnome. Wait, it looks like one of those things from... Earthbound? Mother? It looks like one of those mis- Oh my gosh, it's cute! Since Volt was Undini's opposite, Gnomes is... Ifrit! If we wake up Ifrit, that'll sever their mana flow, right? I have a freak. No, it's Sylph. I also have Sylph. Honestly, how <clears throat> many times do I have to tell you before you actually remember <clears throat> it? I see that the level of education in Silverant matches the status of the world. <laughs> oh, Regal sick bird. Yeah, I guess you could say that. Lloyd, that was not a compliment. <laughs> All right, here we go. That's what she said. I remember the boss for the demo taking me 10 minutes. Yeah, it didn't take me that long. I know. <laughs> mm, Are you used to so Regal yet? Yeah, I haven't tried playing as him. Look. Sorry, but I've already got a pack with Mythos, okay? I did not expect this voice out of Gnome. There's Mythos' name again. He must have been amazing. Lloyd Dumb. <gasps> Is that a Super Mario RPG emote? Oh, I love Super Mario RPG. It's I one of the Shia. best games ever. I seek a pact with Gnome. I ask that thou annul thy pact with Mythos and establish a new pact with me. I'm talking about his voice and appearance. Oh. His voice? I've gotten used to it, but I still love hearing Crispin Freeman talk. And his appearance. His arms keep covering his stomach. So that part I do not approve of. Ugh. I'm di dying for Super Mario RPG to be on Switch. <gasps> yes, they need to bring that and the Sailor Moon RPG to the Switch. And then that'll be my childhood. <laughs> it's the best damn game. Oh, so good. So you're a stomach girl, not a chest one. 
Oh, definitely abs over chest. I'd rather have... Like, it doesn't have to be super defined abs, but just, you know, nice abs over a big chest. Ugh. Ah, uh, you want to see the full package? Yeah, of course I do! Did you- did you not see his character portrait? I want to see those abs! Sailor Moon RPG was so good. It was. It is. Now I really want to play the Sailor Moon RPG again. There's a Sailor Moon RPG? Heck yes, there is. Oh, it's so cute. It's really easy, but it's so cute. Working out, thinning my stomach out, but working out is. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, working out is hard. Stuffy language. Blech. Um. Well, I mean, this is how I was taught to do it. Really? Oh, yeah, well, whatever. All right, show me what you got. Bring it on. Come on. <laughs> Interesting. He's gonna smush her with his butt. This totally sounds like Gino's song from Mario RPG. Taste dirt. He said taste dirt, not the taste of power of Mother Earth. First, led my Ooh, pushed the wrong button, but okay, cool. It was not me this time. Now how much HP are you left with? Wow, that only took out 5,100. Cool. Oh, Regal, why are you so hurt? Ouch! Oh my gosh, that was so cute when she, he gets hurt! Ah! This is freaking cute! Oops! No one's face and getting bogged. <laughs> this face is hilarious, it is! So expressive! To use it. Okay. Whoa, shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay, it's not me. Ooh. me. Yeah, go in. Okay, cool. I forgot. I got new arts. I should use it. Yeah. Cancel out the magic. Ooh, Shino. Okay. Oh, no. Or cool. Whoa. Kill him. Don't think ill of us. We had no choice. Three level ups. Plus two grade. Damn. I did really well. Oh, you guys fight dirty, you know that? I mean, what's up with the four on one garbage? Meet those? <laughs> well, he did it by himself. Well, this temple is all about fourth wall breaking. Oh yeah, well, whatever. Make your vow already. Oh, this guy is hard to deal with. For the sake of creating a place in which the two worlds no longer must sacrifice one another, give me your power. Hmm, well, all right. I'll go ahead and lend my power to you guys. Give me your power. I'll lend it by smashing a giant rock on your head. Oh, so, it's been like, what, uh, 4,000 years? How's it going? 4,000 years? It has been a long time, hasn't it? It seems that the mana flow between us has been severed. Yep, uh, there's gonna be an earthquake here in a bit. After all, we just basically ripped out the mana link. Hello? Hi. Yeah, that pretty much sums it up. Take care, everyone. See y'all later. How about you guys help us out of here? Okay, later. Okay, cool. We're just left on our own. All right, just like we planned. Now get the Still heck out of here.
if the worlds are separated from each other? There is a random window slash doorway on the left. We're not going to be able to see each other again, are we? Why not? We can just go back and forth with the Reons. You guys will be okay. Probably. <laughs> right now, we can move in between the worlds because they're connected by the flow of mana. But if the worlds are split apart, we don't know what will happen. So the instant the flow of mana is severed, the two worlds may part ways forever. No, Crispin Freeman, don't say that. Will that mean that when we form the pact with the final summoned spirit, we'll all have to say goodbye? We don't know if that's really the case, so there's no point in worrying about it right now. Or how about combine the two worlds into one? True. Where shall we go next? I've heard that the summon spirit Celsius resides near Flanor. Where's that? Okay then, let's go have a look. Oh wait, the synopsis will show me. Different worlds, Nani? Yeah, there's two different- there's two worlds, Silverant and, um, Tethiala. So we started off in Silverant, and then we crossed a rift into Tethiala. Because we found out when one world is dying, then the other world is sucking up all the mana and like, haha, we're using it for ourselves. Haha, <laughs> box, ribbon. Gnome is so cute. Cute? Really? Just look at that ribbon on his head. The way it spins and spins and spins. We're talking about ribbons. Perseus is cute too. My ribbon does not spin. Uh, Perseus, wait! Oh, Jesus. Seriously though, I don't think that thing on Gnome is a ribbon. What is it? Mithril Guard! Woo! Wait, really? I can't climb over this? What's the point? How do I get out? Huh? What if I do it again? No? No, seriously, how do I get out of here? Huh? Oh! Wait, no! That's a cliff! 50% what? Should be One is more racist than the other? Oh yeah, that's true. Uh, oh, I'm not healed. Whoopsies! Tefeala is more racist than Silverock. I always thought it was. Yeah, it looks like a ribbon, but what could it possibly be? Don't cast your magic. You picked the wrong guy to- Picked the wrong guy to mess with. How do I get out of here? I can't go over that. There's nothing here. I can't go up- Oh, do I have to go up- Stupid. Stupid- <sighs> 50% Get away from me. Can everyone get away? Can everyone get away? Uh, no. Holy bottle! Don't touch me. Oh no, wait! No, I can't get out! Yeah, it has to be this way! What? <laughs> my roommate's cat just meowed really loud at my door. But she usually never does that. Pick, please. Oh, of the cat? Um... Hmm. Let's see... Can I post up pics on Discord chat? She okay? Shoot, be right back. She's meowing a lot, so... I should check on her.
here. Yep. Okay, hello. <laughs> There's a door in Gnome Room, or I think that was in Zabonia too. Oh wait, ah, uh, shoot, I wonder if I could do this. <laughs> if you hear anything rubbing against the mic, it's the cat. trying to get her face into- <laughs> I'm trying to get her to face the, the camera, but she's not. You're just seeing cat butt. <laughs> So tasty. <laughs> no, Nano Gel, we don't eat animals. We don't eat pets. We do eat animals. Some of them are tasty. Okay. okay. Goodbye. <laughs> You now have to reset my my camera height. Oh gosh! This is all because I tried to show off a kitty. Kitty. Oh, I'm still a little low. Okay, that's good enough. I hope you enjoyed that little bit of cat butt. Oh wait, yeah, I was going to look up how to get out of here. Uh. If you have self afterwards, she will learn <laughs> Exit the Temple of Earth. But how? <laughs> oh my gosh. I mean, this thing fell, so I should be able to go over it, no? There's no more bridges to break. That is so stupid. That is so stupid, and I hate this place. How's about- Oh shoot, now my arm is itchy. Oh, cat allergies. Oh. It's an earthquake! It's just like Gnome said. It's the proof that the flow of mana has been severed. Oh, I should bring the mic closer to me. Whoops. The earthquake at the Renegade base may have been caused by it as well. This building part world is no minor task. One can expect the land to react to these unforeseen events with at least an earthquake or two. Yeah, I have, um... I developed cat allergies, and I'm starting to get dog allergies, too. Um... But with hypoallergenic dogs, like dogs with, um, hair instead of fur, I'm totally okay with them. Uh, my roomie's cat is starting to shed a lot. So my nose has been getting um very sniffly. Go down a little, please. And like um she just brushed her mouth up against my forearm, and so her saliva's making hives appear. Not fun. I should get a desk mic. It's so um convenient and comfy. Nice. I have both too, even with hypoallergenic dogs. Really? That's intense. Yeah, like when I go see my friend's dog, I used to have no problem with him. But then now, if I get too... If I put my face too close to his body, and if I um, pet him a lot, 
that um that I get super sniffly and itchy. And with the cat, she brushes up her face against her mouth against my skin. I start getting hives a little. Ugh. Good thing I don't have any allergy. All the yummy food. <laughs> Not much. <I> no. <laughs> Your stream is really convenient and comfy. It is. It could, there's could be things that are better, like how Streamlabs shouldn't drop my frame rate. But eh, it's good. It gets the job done. It's the dander. It doesn't stop me from petting, though. <laughs> uh, close to his body. <laughs> like if I go hug the puppy. He's not a puppy, though. He's big. He's like 70 pounds. Oh, shoot. These hives are so itchy. Oh, gosh. Anyways, where's Flanmore? Uh. It just said north. Blah, 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 blah. I'm gonna go now play a little bit more of Yakuza 5 and go to sleep. Okay, Nanoja, thanks for watching. Have a good night. My friend's dog is like six months old and he's giant. Ooh, what kind of dog is it? Actually, is my camera a little too high? Oh, that's a little, a little. Just a touch. Yeah, nice. Okay, I need to find out where Flanwar is, so I'm gonna look at a map. Okay, so it's this ice place. Maybe I should stop by the city of Flanwar first, just to see if there's any new ingredients to get and stuff. Then I'll go to Temple of Ice. Yes, hello! The snowy city, Flanwar. Who is this guy kneeling? Are you alright? Ugh. Please, hang on! I'm sorry, it seems I've been struck by evil energy. Evil energy? Do you, by any chance, possess the Devil's Arms? I do not. Devil's Arms? The evil lie that you possess is one of the Devil's Arms. I have an evil lie? Who are you? My apologies, my name is Abyssian. I'm the last surviving member of a family of demon hunters. I'm Lloyd. I'm on a journey with my companions. What does a family of demon hunters do? There was once a man named Nebulum who attempted to conquer Tethiala. Nebulum was eventually defeated by a single swordsman, but his lingering hatred fused itself into the swordsman's nine pieces of arms and cursed the swordsman's descendants. Nine? I only have... Seven. I get two more people? Well, wow, that's pretty scary. The family of demon hunters are the descendants of the swordsman who defeated Nebulum. Every member of my family lost their lives to the curse of the Devil's Arms. That's terrible. Can anything be done? If all nine items are gathered and sealed, the family curse will be lifted. That's why you asked about, about the Devil's Arms. Yes, however, the curse has progressed more quickly than I expected. And I, too, have been struck by Nebulum's evil energy. I think it will be difficult for me to continue gathering the de Devil's Arms in my condition. Let's help him, Lloyd. Yeah, after all, we already have some Devil's Arms. Let's find the rest ourselves. Are you sure? It is not a minor task. Dorvan vow number two. Never abandon someone in need. Then please take the sword and key. The Devil's Arms carry the will of Nebulum, and the pieces respond to each other. When this sword reacts, you will surely find the Devil's Arms in that area. When you have collected all the arms, please return to Flanmar. Hmm. Ooh, this guy. You've been hit by... You've been struck by evil energy. <laughs> you got the evil eye from the mines? Oh. Your dudes can carry different types of weapons. Oh. Zealous can equip two different types of weapons. So yeah, nine total. Oh, okay, okay. Does the curse of the devil's arms affect anyone besides members of your family? Hmm? No, it shouldn't. What is it, Prisea? No, it's nothing. Okay, then. We'll be back soon, Abyssian. Thank you. I'm in your debt. I have a... Okay. Evil eye. Evil eye. It's a weapon? 
Oh! So if I give it to Colette... Oh, I have eight members. Oh, whoopsies. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. How do I... Maybe... Does it get... Ow. I pinched my nose too hard. Ugh. Does it get stronger with any for every enemy you defeat? Because then maybe I'll just give her the evil eye now. Then should I put her in my party so that she kills things? She's gonna be super weak though. Oi! 500 gold, yeah, do it. Oh wait, I just rested, didn't I? Oh well, whatever. Heal out. Let's see if there's a. Oh wait, since Colette is here, I could give her super special stuff from, um, whatchamacallit. Ah, excuse me. Altamira. Do you by chance have any Celsius tier? Celsius tier? What's that? Celsius tier is a famous ice flower in Flanoir. It has the mysterious power to freeze anything. Freeze anything? I don't know of anything like that. I see. If you find any, please let me know. I'll pay whatever you ask. Give me five million gold. Okay. Also, be careful when handling a Celsius tier. If you touch it directly, you'll be badly burned. Then how do we get it? You'll be fine if you touch it with penguinist claws. <laughs> Ask the old man at the Snow White accessory shop about it. Okay, where, where's the shop? <laughs> they do get stronger with each kill, but their power isn't unleashed until you finish the side quest. Well then, I'm not gonna equip it now. Boo! Optimal. Uh, what are you? I think I'm going to catch a cold by the time my turn comes. I'm cutting all of you. <laughs> Hi, talk to me. You all have colds too, right? Almost every patient who comes here has a cold. I wonder why. Because it's freaking freezing here, dude. Poor Colette. <laughs> Toss to the side. I wonder at what exact point it stops feeling cold. When you're dead. Would you like some fresh vegetables? Yes. Ooh, temporarily increase attack by 10%. Give me some. 10 juicy meat, beef strips, potato, carrot, uh, rice pasta, white satay, red satay, black satay. Oh, shoot. No fruits, though. Damn it. Can't make my fruit cocktail. Aren't you cold dressed like that? No. Regal must stay coatless. <laughs> Welcome! Accessories! Mm, ooh, stone charm would be handy to have. Um... Heal brace the spirit of black garlands with max TP by 30%. Oh wow, super expensive. Never mind. Max HP by 30%. Oh, that sounds so good. Hmm, you want to know about the penguinist gloves? Penguinist gloves are nice, warm mittens made from quills of penguinists which dwell in ice caves. Hmm, let me see if you had three penguinist quills, I can make a pair for you. Where are the ice caves? I hate this town's layout. Just where is the weapons and armor shop? Over here. Whoa! Ice statues. Wonder Chef. <laughs> Pac Man. <laughs> Bigfoot. Oh, these are really cute. I was hoping that the Wonder Chef sculpture would turn into Wonder Chef. Oh no, this is cats. Oh no, weapon and armor shop. Great material exchange. 691 grade. Eh, I'll save it. Thanks, bub. Uh, quit the customization? We're not doing customization yet? Then what the heck are you good for? Um, Thunder Scepter, Card of Ice, Lightning Sword, Power Freeze, Ancient Robe. Okay, so I guess this one I couldn't get for Rain in Altamira. 
Dual Helm. Okay. Equip. Rain. Op Oops. Optimal and optimal. Boop, 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 boop. Thanks, boop! Coronavirus. <laughs> he's a doctor and he's wondering why people get colds. Not the smartest dude. Whoa. Now I wonder if Jelly will remember to use them. I won't. I will never remember to use them. Uh, what's this? Ooh. We can continue onward with the guidance of Martel no matter what the climate or where the location is. We go on a journey. It is a good creed. Sure. This is the Flannoir Bench of the Church of Martel. I should not be in a church. Because I know it's evil. Jump off! <laughs> for, <laughs> for a quick second, I thought I was playing Final Fantasy XIV, so I was like, yeah, just jump off the castle wall. You'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Because this town reminds me of um, Stormblood. No, not Stormblood. Heaven's Word. All the snowy elven towns. Uh, what's up here? Oh, this is just another way to get the. Ah, oh, frack. I should have just come down this way. Oh, well. Okay, Temple of Ice it is. Yeah, I think I have enough time to do Temple of Ice before I end for tonight. Where was Temple of Ice? Oh, Temple of Ice was down this way. <gasps> Skit! Or special thing! Let's go! Wait! Wait! He's... He's not at my party! It's Kratos! I don't know how to answer him! I'll leave him alone? What are you doing? No! What are you doing? It's you. I was just looking at the sky. Don't lie. Hmm, then how about... I was scheming how to get rid of those that are in Lord Yggdrasil's way. Now are you satisfied? You seem well. What? Boy, don't be so trusting. There may be those close to you who are malicious. Like you? <laughs> You're talking about yourself. Hmm, we'll see. Be ever judicious. Now I shall excuse myself. I forgot to ask what judicious means! <laughs> Why was he there? That was so freaking random. I was like, wait. Crush Toes isn't in my party anymore. How can he appear? But then I'm like, oh, this is the world map. I don't care for pointless. Oh wait, no, I've already examined it before. These guys are the same dudes. That's it? I've been gone for a minute. Why is he back? He's not really back, but this skit marker on the world map just happened to be with Crush Toes. And I was like, whoa, why? And how do I get in here? Okay. Their relationship. I wonder what the relationship between Regal and Prisea is. Beats me. It sure seems like Regal has her on his mind, though. I wonder if he has a crush on her. Ew, no. No way, their age gap difference is way too great. It's an adult and a child. Yeah, I guess you're right. I wouldn't be so sure about that. What do you mean? Age difference has no meaning in love. I know a countess who married a man 30... Ew! 30 years younger than she is. Gross. <sighs> Perse is mine! I won't give her up! Whoa, brave words, genus. Damn, he's really trying to go after her. That's how it should be. If you're interested in someone, let them know. Just be straightforward about, like, hey, I like you. Because the other person might have no idea. Okay. <gasps> A 
penguin! A penguin! Ooh, I'm sliding. I'm interested care. in your cat. I want a cat. <laughs> well, she's not my cat. She's my roommate's cat. Penguinist! Let me cut. Jelly dice. Thanks. I, I, I like and appreciate all of you. I'm gonna head out, Nightgels. Nightweb, thanks for joining! Okay, I only need one more penguinist quill and then I get that um, penguinist glove. Ancient robe. Did I not just buy one? I bought one for her. Well, that was a waste of my bajillions of money. I would fight these all, but I just want to finish really quick. What does it do now? Whoa, the ring suddenly got cold! I bet you could use the ring's cold power to freeze anything! Okay, then let's test it on you! That's not funny. Lloyd! I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Hi, Penguinist. More battles? Oh wait! These are kids inside the penguin costumes. I'm beating up children. This does not feel good. Oh gosh, why are there children here? That was just warm enough. In a cool voice, Jelly. I stutter. If Crispin Freeman could say that, oh gosh, that would be the best. Crispin Freeman. Okay, so supposedly I can freeze all this stuff, and then I'll slide down. More Murder them. <laughs> Gotta be kidding me, <laughs> calling the police now. No, don't! I didn't mean to attack them, but they're attacking me, so now it's self-defense. That was just warming up. <laughs> warming up. Get it? <laughs> Funny joke. Mithril armor. Oh my gosh, I'm finding all these things that I bought in Altamira. Yeah. <laughs> Crispin Freeman voice. <laughs> what the freak is this? Bigfoot. And there's a spider. Uh, ice spider. Wow, the Bigfoot also gets that weird, like, face. I have not used any art since I came in here. Okay, it's safe to cross to the side. Uh... How do I freeze the water? Okay. I guess there is a bigger source to take out first. Why am I able to go up here? There's nothing there. Oh! Ice cube! Can I push it down? No. Okay. Can you grab it? Thank you. I mean, can I bring you all the way down this way? Jelly's favorite bug. What's my favorite bug? I don't like bugs. Okay, so I froze this, but I can't move it anywhere. I make. Can I make more than one? No, I can only make one. So, what is the purpose of this? Was there another dripping icicle here? There was. Okay. Can I knock you into the water? I can. And now I can walk across. Salmon. If we freeze the lake, it looks like we can walk to the other side. Yes, I said that. But I can't freeze it here. Or I just have to keep shooting it. Huh? It 
It's no good, it won't freeze. The water flow is too strong. We'll have to think of another way. Now that I think about it, there was someone in Flanora who said that the Celsius tier can freeze anything. Oh yeah, he did. Right. Then let's look for Celsius tier. You remember he said it's in the ice caves, right? Yes, I do. Right, and these are the ice caves. Did you know that if you touch the Celsius tier, you'll be poisoned? No, you'll be burned. I didn't know that. That was a joke. It's not poisonous. It'll burn you when you touch it. That's why you need the penguinous gloves, so you don't get burned. First, we need to get those penguinous gloves. Okay, so I have to leave this dungeon anyway. Crack. These dungeons are getting so tedious and annoying. It's like, hey, go in. Hey, go back out. Hey, go in. Go back out. I shouldn't explore anymore until I get the penguinous gloves, just in case. Oh, I'm guessing that's the Celsius tier. So yeah, going up there would not be helpful right now. I don't want to run into that dude. Hmm, then maybe... Maybe I should just end stream after I get the penguinous glove. Whoop! Damn it. I don't care for points. Whoa! Hello! Uh, Ice Warrior and Feather Magic. <laughs> oh, spi yeah, spiders are gross. If spiders are far away from me, I don't mind, because it's like, yes, thank you for eating all the other bugs. But if they're really close to me, I'm just like, no, creepy. Wait, Sheena, were you healing this dude? Oh, it's because you have cars of ice on. Redemption still eludes me. Redemption. Yeah, we're gonna put, uh... Lightning on you. Thinking she was healing the dudes, that's why they weren't dying. Why are you putting all those spinner racks on? Gross! Oh wow, he came out of nowhere. You're in real world of hurt. <laughs> Boy. Is everyone all right? We're all right, Prisea. Are you all right? Does it bug you that much? <laughs> Whoa, is it just me, or did it get darker in this town? It looks like nighttime is falling. Uh, ex this is an accessory shop. This is. Hi. Oh, you have three penguin squills. I'll make you a pair of penguin gloves. Give the quills to me. Give them to him. Oh, good, good. This is my first job in a while. Now, just wait there a minute. There, it's done. It's a pair of penguinous gloves. Please, take them. Thanks, dude. Am I hurt? Well, let's go rest at the end. Ooh. Oi. I should keep looking for Wondershot too. Eh. I'm very diligent about that. Yes, give me a room, please. Frame rate isn't dropping. Okay, so I guess I shouldn't put Streamlabs priority to high on Windows because that seems to mess it up. Okay, then next time I. I stream tomorrow when I stream. Um, I'll try not putting it to high priority. See if I get that frame rate problem again. But for tonight, I am tired and I'm going to end here. I think it's a good place to end so that I could just do the whole ice temple next time. So I did lightning, 
earth. This is gonna be ice, so I need to do one more here. And then, yeah, I'll be closer to the end of the game. Woo! Good night, nerd. Good night. Thanks for watching, I'll see y'all next time. Stay toasty. Have a good night, everyone. Bye-bye!